scenes are played, but realistically, nah, they don't approve of it. The realized style, they would say, is demonic, too scary, too spooky. Stuff like that. That caused me to feel sad and depressed. That and while having communicating with certain friends who weren't necessarily they didn't really vibe with me too well. And we know it's getting along. I felt a little bit depressed, got a little bit toxic. Pretty much was a toxic little, like, a little bit mad. A toxic, a little, a little toxic, like a little toxic little, a little, a little messy. Messy mean. I felt a little bit bullied, even though it wasn't really bullied, it was just them disapproving of my lifestyle, they didn't really like my heart style, they wouldn't be real like the way I dressed a bit, they changed a bit. Over time, they change a little bit, but it's still not like they're going to accept me do it. It's just more like, okay, I understand what you like, but still, we don't really accept that, so I'm not going to argue with them. I'm not going to argue with people. You shouldn't really hire your people in order to accept you. And don't come out the closet unless you feel completely comfortable. It's a very safe situation. That's just my advice. And this one's... I wasn't able to really buy stuff I had to follow rules. I live with family and friends to all live with friends in 2019 I moved out 2020 2021 I see 2021 for me it was a roller coaster but I was able to move out started Get myself together a little bit. Wanted things and talk to people online. Talk to people online. Not really online, just people in general. This online. It wasn't necessarily okay. My sleep when I had was were bad, eating habits was a little funny, a little funky. And I really felt comfortable too much with my body. I still don't really feel comfortable with my body still go through dreams just for it, but it's not as bad. I can tolerate certain things. And this is, this is when I started to dress as just more feminine. Like more girly, more creepy art cult stuff, and more into magic. Was 
was a magic in 2017, 2016, too. It changed, and something changed in 2021. I came out as pan in trance or something like that, something along those lines. To standing, to standing up for myself. It's hard to standing up for myself and putting myself on depression. In the trap lifestyle, my own comfort bubble push myself out now I'm more like when I think about those things those things come forward come forward towards me I'm like oh, I see what you need to because I don't feel comfortable with this person so 